so welcome to microbial concepts so in this video we are going to discuss about b6 related to the micro metal interaction okay so in environment there are uh, various niches where you will find that micro metal interaction is going on continuously so we are going to study some of the b6 related to this topic so micro metal interactions these are complex processes by which microorganisms like bacteria fungi they interact with the metals in their environment okay any given environment where that particular microbe is present okay so these interactions can be beneficial they can be neutral or they can be detrimental to the microorganisms and their surrounding ecosystem that depends on what type of interaction it is so this is a simple image where you can see various types of interactions are given like bioabsorption uh, bioaccumulation microbially enhance chemoabsorption of metals then biomineralization biotransformation bioleaching etc now some of these are uh, you will find they are applicable when we study bioremediation okay in microbiology so these are the mechanisms that can be used in bio now let's study some examples where you will find micro metal interactions so first is metal tolerance so we know that some of the microorganisms they have developed mechanisms through which they can tolerate high levels of metals okay like metal toxicity is something that deals with this point so for example certain bacteria they can detoxify heavy metals such as lead or cadmium by sequestering them inside their cell and then by converting them into less toxic forms okay so this is also a uh, one of the applications uh, and you will study this in bioremediation as well okay bioremediation of heavy metals now bioremediation so microbes uh, they can be used to remediate sites polluted with metals okay so the same point again like certain fungi or certain bacteria they have the ability to reduce the concentration of metals in soil and in water by sequestering them or by precipitating or by oxidizing them now this helps us to clean up the mine tilling or mine tailing then industrial waste contaminated water sources etc then comes metal extraction so some microbes they have ability to extract metals from ores or waste materials okay something related to bio leaching so for instance certain bacteria can oxidize metal sulfides such as iron or copper to uh, extract the metal ions from the mineral and make them available for use okay then comes corrosion so some bacteria they produce sulfuric acid okay so this accelerates the corrosion process of the metals so where uh, you can find this interaction for example where the water pipes or tanks are there where microorganisms are present naturally so if a particular bacteria is growing on a large number and it is producing sulfuric acid then you will find that the pipe is getting corroded naturally so thus they can alter the chemical properties of the metal and potentially they can cause corrosion then metal mobilization so microbes they can mobilize metals in environment making them more available for the uptake of plant and other organisms for example um, potassium mobilizing bacteria is what you study in biofertilizers okay so this is related to that so for example certain fungi like mycorrhiza they can dissolve metal oxides in uh, soil and they can make them easily available for the plant uptake okay then metal reducing bacteria so some bacteria such as shivanella onidensis can reduce metals like iron magnesium uh, sorry manganese allowing them to use these metals as electron acceptors during their respiration process then sulfate reducing bacteria so some bacteria like desulfovibrio desulfuricans can reduce sulfate to hydrogen sulfide and can also reduce metals like iron and manganese okay so this uh, so this process can cause metal sulfides to precipitate out of solution which can have important implications for formation of iron deposits okay so these are some examples uh, where you will find or 
these are examples which you can write in your answer as well if you have question like uh, what is microbe metal interaction give some examples explain on that okay so what are the advantages of microbe metal uh, interactions so very first we can use them in bioremediation right to remediate contaminated environments like soil water and uh, this is more cost effective and environmental friendly than traditional remediation methods then uh, bio mining another advantage where microbes can be used to extract uh, metals from ores more efficient and less environmentally damaging method okay so this is second then third is metal recovery so microbes they can be used to recover metal from waste stream such as industrial effluents which can be recycled and reused fourth is ecological role so microbes they participate in biogeochemical cycling of metals right carbon cycle nitrogen cycle likewise metal cycles then influencing their mobility transformation and availability in ecosystem then comes some disadvantages so some microorganisms that interact with metals they have ability to accumulate them and transform toxic metals so this can pose a risk if these bacteria are released into any other environment okay then second is microbes from biofilm can also accelerate corrosion of metals by producing acids or other corrosive compounds during metabolic processes so if biofilm is formed on any metal surface it is going to corrode so we need to first inhibit biofilm formation so that the corrosion can be stopped or avoided then microbes that interact with metals they often exhibit selectivity or specificity towards certain metals or metal forms now this can limit their applicability in case where multiple metals are needed to be targeted or in environment with complex metal mixtures are present okay so uh, this is related to disadvantage related to bioremediation application okay so if a microbe is having a certain selectivity or specificity towards a metal or metal form then that there you may find limitation to its applicability in that case okay if there are multiple metals present in a given uh, bioremediation site so this was a short video related to metal micro metal interaction so i hope this is helpful uh, so do like my videos, do share my videos with your friends and do subscribe to my channel. Thank you.